What's up guys? This is Chase with EnergyToConquer.com. This is day one of 100 on my challenge. Uh, the challenge, don't really have a name for it. I'm just gonna push, uh, gonna try some different things. Gonna see how we can max out my energy and see if we can grow some muscle and just see what happens. Just basically, just, just kind of go all in and see if we can sculpt my body see what changes we can make and what changes we can make in our energy so look here i see jordan belfort who does these videos it looks so nice in california but we're in north carolina so this is what you get you get to watch me walk around in a field so just wanted to share that with you anyways guys um Started a workout today, it was the first day of the workout, our strength training program, just something completely new. I'd started 75 hard, oh, probably, I don't know, a month and a half ago, two months ago now, but I got about 27 days in. I started with a foot injury, so I don't know, some kind of tear or something on the bottom of my foot, so I thought I could just work through it. Kept getting worse and worse and worse, so about day, day, day 27, I pulled back, um, and I kind of thought I'd take two weeks but i keep re-injuring it just playing with kids whatever so i can't really stay off of it so i'm trying to go a different direction right now until i can get that healed up but one of the things i come to realization is i don't really have a plan b whenever i do have lower limb injuries so started to work out a jim stepani workout on one of his programs today i've kind of got limited equipment um, i've got dumbbells and a bench I've got some bands I purchased off Amazon, kind of have the clips on the ends and so you can put different stuff on the ends and use them basically like a cable machine. Um, I've got a pull-up station outside, I use a lot of my outside workouts on, so I've been using that for, goodness, probably going on two years now, and that is, I've got, I can probably do two or three workouts on that. It's amazing what you can do on just body weight stuff on that machine or piece of equipment, I guess. But um, yeah, that's it. Day one. The day took me longer to get set up on the program. I knew it was going to take a while. It actually ended up taking longer than I anticipated. Just trying to figure out how to substitute some of the workouts and how to hook up the bands. I bought those bands probably a year ago and I've never used them. I actually took them out of the pack so just how to anchor them anchor them on the door high and low and just figuring out different ways how much resistance i need that sort of stuff so it ended up being almost two hours it went way over but we got to trim that down just part of the process figuring out a new system completely new workout haven't done that type of workout before it was a hit workout um he does two sets together then rests then does those two sets again, does that three three times, then does hit for seven minutes. Um, actually does two two sets like that. So you're really getting four different exercises in, but you're doing your sets together on two of them. Then does seven minute hit in between. So yeah. So a little bit tired, I can feel it. That's it's gonna be some getting used to, but also following along on some other programs. I'll be sharing some of those with you that I'm doing. Um, I work from home on a digital marketing agency. So kind of blessed with that. Um, so I can take breaks throughout the day and do different things. So I'm gonna be experimenting with some different things to kind of give me more energy. Cause sitting just kills me and it really sucks the life out of me. So you guys get to go along for that. If you guys are interested, just follow, uh, subscribe. You can go check out the website, energytoconquer.com. We're launching it with this series, this 100-day challenge. Um, but the whole the whole point is just having energy to conquer. Jim Rohn says, most people don't do well because they don't feel well. And I've definitely been there in my life. This energy is something I've always struggled with. And I know part of it's mental and a big part of it's physical. So here recently, I've started exploring, probably in the last year, 
strength workouts. I've not really done a whole lot of strength workouts. Um, I did a lot of cardio, a lot of running, that kind of stuff. Um, but my frame's bigger, so it's almost like I was trying to to get smaller than my natural frame instead of playing to my natural strength. Um, so now I'm trying to play to my natural strength. I'm kind of stockier by nature. Um, so, you know, these guys, 160 pounds, 170 pounds, they'd probably love to be where I'm at. And I was killing myself running, doing different things, trying to get down lower. And I experimented with vegan, and raw vegan, and all kinds of stuff, like low carb, keto. Um, don't really binge on diets, but just really trying to get more energy, just trying to figure things out. Um, so, a lot of that stuff's coming into this. 100 days i'll share some stuff with you um and i'm still gonna be trying i'm experimenting with a lot of stuff so you guys are kind of witnessing my experiments here but this 100 days the whole point is to the point is to see how much see if i can maximize my energy see how much i can do see how far i can go um if i push so it's his serving as accountability for me um and it's also so we're launching energy to conquer.com and that's what it's about you know for business people that's trying to get more energy so they can do more in life not necessarily business people but mainly the targets business um just so you can be more effective so you can get more done so you can basically become a high performance individual because if you're eating like shit you feel like shit you're not exercising there's no way that you can ever reach your potential if that's what you're trying to go for. So that's who we're catering to, and that's what we're trying to figure out. So you're on this journey with us, and if you're interested in that sort of thing, I want to figure out how you can have a clear mind, focus longer. Um, you know, I, I, my goal has always been to be as sharp at the first sales meeting in the morning as the last one in the evening. And sometimes that's five, six, seven, eight o'clock, depending on what I was selling at the time. So that's where we're at. This is day one. I know it's gonna be a beast. Yeah, I've completed 75 hard. I'm probably gonna jump back into 75 hard. The reason I'm not in 75 hard right now while I'm doing this is because of my foot injury and primarily my outside, it consists of cardio. My outside workouts so on that program you do one outside workout and i have limited equipment and i don't really want to get my dumbbells and stuff rusty so just working on some of that stuff and trying to work out a plan b um, but i'm going to jump into that so i may finish this thing out with 75 hard uh, we'll see where it goes but anyways glad to have you guys along catch up with you guys tomorrow